Today, TJ's is going to show you how to make ceviche. Let me ask you a question. Can you mix ingredients in a bowl? Can you set a timer? All right, you can make ceviche. It is literally one of the easiest things you will ever make in your kitchen. You've got protein, which today is our fresh mahi-mahi. And you have citrus. After that, it's up to your imagination. And it's simple. All we're gonna do is combine our ingredients in a bowl. We're gonna start with our small diced fish. Add some diced jalapenos, some fresh tomatoes, a little bit of cilantro, some Peruvian purple potatoes, red onion, and then lemon and lime juice. Your citrus should actually cover everything in the dish. Now we're gonna add just a little bit of salt for flavor and a dash of hot sauce. And now we wait. All we're gonna do is cover it in plastic and stick it in the fridge. Got some plastic wrap here. You don't wanna just cover the top, you wanna put it all the way down so there's no air. Nice airtight seal. Now I'm just gonna put it in the fridge. All right, so we just took our ceviche out of the fridge. Now how long do you need ceviche to sit? Um, if your fish is sushi grade and spectacular, it can be as little as 90 seconds, or it can be as long as a couple hours. Overnight, in our opinion, actually tends to be a little bit too long for fish. It'll actually start to break down the protein of the fish and you have kind of mushy ceviche. We don't want that. So, it's simple. Take our top off. It tastes a little bit. Oh, spectacular. I'm gonna add just a little bit more salt to taste and a dash more hot sauce for heat. And our ceviche is ready to go. All we need to do is plate it up. Oh, looks beautiful. Look at all those great colors. Such a beautiful dish. I wanna get lots of that leche de tigre, which is the uh, citrus juice after it's marinated. So now that you know how to mix ingredients in a bowl, set a timer, refrigerate it, there's no excuse anybody can make ceviche.